guys, what's up? And and today is about kayaks because I just um I paid and this thing. kayak was about a little over two hundred bucks I think. Mm -hmm. I think it was two hundred and twenty fives, but two hundred and forty plus the like you know tax thing. But guys, um, we got our own fishing kayak with a C. Oh, oh, with the seat locked down or something. Then we got our paddle and everything. Dry storage, bun a little bit of bungee cords. Not only one kayak, but two kayaks. One's in the back of my, still in the back of my dad's truck. But like, look, a kayak. We're gonna be practicing in the pool. If you're looking for a first kayak, this is a Lifetime Tahoma Sit On Top Kayak. Length, it's 10 foot. And um, this, the, for the kayak itself, is 50 pounds. And the capacity that it can weigh is, it can, is um, if you're over 275 pounds, don't get this kayak. Right? Ooh, this, this is a neat looking kayak paddle. We just clip them together. I'm trying to see. And guys, I think um this oh oh my goodness, there's a wasp. So good. But guys, this is what you hold on to when you're like dragging it back to like the shore. If you fell off what I like about sit ons is if you fall down, you can just get right back on it, right? Mm -hmm. That's what they say. So uh, guys, I'm also, since I got nothing on this, I want to see also, first I'm going to test it out and then I'm going to see what it has to take to tip this thing over, right? Mm -hmm. And guys, you can put like a tackle box or something, or in this, it's wrapped in bungee cord though, Just dry storage. And um, we also got, we have all of this stuff. See guys, the thing is that last night we found these kayaks outside of Walmart and some red sit-in ones, you know. This one was $225 and the red ones were $188. But um, we, one guy said, one guy said um, it, he was at a bait shop. If you want it to fish in a kayak, you should normally have a sit-on kayak. Yep, we're good. This is dry storage, you think? Mm-hmm. Well, you can actually fit a lot of stuff. But it's all the way mm -hmm. through, so you gotta put something in there to kind of hold it. All right. So <clears throat> there's two of these things. Don't you use these as you, as you, and you grab it and you pull it back to shore? Yeah. I think that's what those things. All right, hold on. Oh, this is a pretty heavy kayak. Uh, I, I, I found one, one kayak that was like, I think, five pounds or something. I got it. Let go. Okay. All right, guys. Put the kayak in the pool. Hey, guys. What's up? And, uh, today we're in the kayak. And uh, like I showed you earlier, there's a one kayak in the room. Because we are going to also be attaching a rod holder for our rod. And I'm going to see what it takes to take this thing over. Okay. Here. Yeah, <laughs> I would recommend that. 
I thought you were going to try to turn it over. Push you off. Yeah, I'm not gonna be going too far. I know. Got a turn in. No. no. Easy to paddle like this. Mm hmm. There's like barely any currents or anything here. Yep. I'm not going to go over there. We're going to go to about right here. Now, so you can turn around by back pedaling with your right hand. Oh. There you go. Now, pedal with your left. Oh. And forward with your left. There you go. Look at you go. Ready, set, go. All right, turn, turn. turn. Well, turn's gonna get landed. Oh, land is catching up. Land Dylan's gonna win. <laughs> <laughs> 